this. Oh, shit. Did you do? Who is they? I was just asking you the same thing. Where are we? Do I know you? Got it. No, you look familiar. Where the fuck are we? The desert. No shit. <laughs> I'm Martin. Jake. I'm an investment banker. What about you? You got anything to drink? Instead of down there. Do you have a cell phone? You do? Knock yourself out. And while you're at it, why don't you call your secretary? Let her know you ain't gonna make it to the motel to bang her brains out tonight. And while you're at it, why don't you call her to tell me to bring me some fucking water? Do <laughs> you think I didn't already try that shit? <laughs> I bet our kidneys are in some fucked up operating room in China right now. If it doesn't make sense, why would they drop us out of here? I said we keep moving. We? <laughs> you trying to bond with me now? Because I ain't in the mood. Maybe we can find a road or a path or something. Yo! What? Phone! What? Phone! Do nothing with it. I don't know what the fuck I want to do with it. Remember? Remember? About before. Not. How about you? I was at work. No, wait a second. I was at home. This is with my wife. We were arguing. I can't remember. Imagine that. Arguing with a wife. No, no. Anna and I never fought. This is this is different. Yeah. Well. I kind of remember. What? what? I kind of remember being at a funeral. Yeah. 
What's that? Huh? Is that a body? Hey. Sir! Welcome to the club, baby. You are fucked. Nice. What nice, am I Jake. supposed to tell Real her? Pretty. Real pumpkin. What am I supposed to tell her? Huh? Well, it's gonna be okay. Pretty fucking far from okay, in case you haven't noticed. What's your name? Grace. Do we know each other? No. Now you said the same thing to me? I just thought it was some kind of queer pickup line or something. Knock it off, Jake. Grace, you're gonna be okay. I'm Martin. Do you remember how you got here? No. What's the last thing you remember? I was in my dark room developing a, a film, and then... You're a photographer? How did you find me here? Out of all these dunes, how, why did you walk up to this one? Well, look at the draw. <laughs> Did you actually say luck? Great, yeah. Now we got three hungry mouths to feed. You know what? Why, why don't we? Why don't we just set out and look for like a fourth lost soul in the great expanse of fucking nothingness, and then we could like start a band. You know, you play an instrument. That would be great. Jake, Jake, knock it off.
the truth? She's not even fucking cut! Yeah, right, Jake. We'll do your way. We'll kill her and then we'll ask a question. We'll kill her! Are you? No, okay! Stop it! Look, I don't know, okay? I was at my job and woke up here. All I know is. Oh, oh I've got this huge pain in my back. She was following she, us. Then why does she have pain in the same place that we have our wounds? Here. Look. What's your name? Rachel. Where are we, huh? What's going on? We don't know. Come on. Listen, I say we move on. We're heading west. Who knows how many more people we're gonna find? Rachel? Do you know me? Kidney's gonna burst. Or, or maybe she's already got one of us inside of her and her body's rejected. She doesn't have a scar, Jake. But she might be onto something. We may be connected to her. Huh? Listen, we've been walking for miles. We're bound to hit something soon. Let's just keep going. I don't get it. Why take our organs and then bring us here? The kidneys filter the waste from our blood. But in traditional Chinese medicine, it stores what's called the essence. They believe it's, it's responsible for growth and development. They um, believe our internal organs are connected. You know a lot of shit, huh? Bottom line. The kidneys are vital to life. I hope they get some decent scratch for mine. Kidneys eat water. Lots of water. And coincidentally, we are in a place with no water. You think that there's a connection? should stay awake in case there's a search party or something. Where the fuck do you get these? I don't know. It's the first time I've seen them, I swear. Really? What, so they just like magically appeared in your pocket? Four of them? I told you guys she was in on it, huh? She's been fucking with us the whole time. Why didn't you say anything? I'm telling the truth. 
<laughs> Great. It's just enough light we can watch each other die. He's dead weight, man. We gotta get rid of her. What are you saying, Jake? What do you mean? We're just gonna leave her here? I didn't say that. What are you saying? If you get some sleep, you think you'd be able to walk? I don't know. I'm just feeling so sick. Hey, you guys wanna know what I think? No. I think if she dies, we shouldn't let her body go to waste. What are you saying? <laughs> You're joking. Either we all die, or she dies. And we live. Huh? We're not doing this. Why not? Because when I get back, I'm not going to jail. Oh, that's fucking good. You guys still haven't figured it out, have you? We're already dead. Huh? Fucking rave sticks or not, man. We ain't got any water. We ain't got any food. We still don't know where the fuck we are. Fucking joke, man. You want some of this? I'm so just saying that you use Enough! It. Enough! Stop it! Now go to sleep. We'll see how everyone is in the morning. Now go to sleep. They sold a suit. Like a butcher sells some meat. <sighs> yeah, don't you want to know what they actually did to you? Why they did it? <laughs> it's an urban legend, Jake. There's no evidence that anyone's ever been drugged or had their kidneys stolen. Bullshit. This kind of shit happens all the time, man. It's a myth. What's the explanation? Uh, somehow we're all connected. I've seen all of you before. I already told you, man. We, we were in the same circles. What if this is some kind of alien abduction and we're the victims of some weird experiment? Well, that makes as much sense as anything else. <laughs> we're being tested. <laughs> By who? No, 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 Rachel, Rachel, huh? Rachel, look, open your eyes, open your eyes. Thought you said it was just a myth. <laughs> oh, God. No, no. This isn't real. Speak for yourself. All right, let's say it's just a dream then, okay? If it's just a dream, then I can do anything I want to do, right? What difference does it make, man? 
I'm already dead, right? You want to know what's behind door number one, Martin, but you're too scared to look. You're used to letting everybody do your dirty work for you. I need you in that meeting, David. I need you watching my back. And what if they have questions about the numbers? They're like piranhas in there. You disgust me. Jake, don't do it. Oh, fuck you! Stop it, Martin, and make him stop. Jake, don't do it. <sighs> don't do what? Huh? Why don't you stop me? You talk a big game, man. When it comes down to it, you're just chicken shit. Oh! Stop it! <laughs> no, God! something inside of me. Jake. No, Jake, you gotta stop. Stop! <laughs> Can you eat now? What? You just buried your best friend and your... <gasps> you disgust me. are gonna nail those motherfuckers to the wall. You really think so? Oh man, wait till you see Walton's face when I pull out the first quarter numbers. You're right, he is gonna fucking shit himself. What are you talking about? <laughs> you know what the worst part is? That you just keep denying it. Sweetheart. Sorry to 
head in this way. What are you doing here? I was going to ask you the same thing, Martin. Thanks for bringing me to the meeting, man. You kidding? I'm going to be putting on the show, man. You crunched the numbers. You did all the work. It's all you, buddy. Yeah. All right. <laughs> My respects. Good show. Impressive. You know the way your your eyes would well up to tears, but not break into a hysterical sob. David was my best friend. Oh, hey, sweetie. Yeah, well, I'm I'm in the car with Martin. We're on our way to the meeting. Hey, Miranda. What about me? I loved you. Of course I did. But there's a limit to your love? The risk was high, Miranda. I have a lot of obligations. People depend on me. People at work, Anna. Your husband, he depended on me. Ba baby, what's wrong? What? I thought you were just going in for a checkup. Oh. But you weren't there when he really needed you, Martin. When I really needed you. Where the hell did you come from? <laughs> Fuck if I know, man. <laughs> Where were you? I don't, I don't know. I just, I, it was a bunch of palm trees and shit. I don't know. Whatever the fuck it was, it was fucking paradise, man. There was a huge table full of food, and, and I ate and I drank until I puked, and then and, and I ate some more, and and, and then I, I got kind of tired because I ate a lot of turkey, so I lay down and took a nap, and. Uh, now I'm back here with you fucks. In hell. But now it's like apparently a, a new and improved damp, watery hell. <laughs> it turns out I'm the king of my fuck land. And you're my court jester. Oh, and then what am I? That would make you two lovelies my uh, court concubines. <laughs> In your dreams. Speaking of dreams. Oh, yeah, yeah, let me, let me, let me, let me, let me guess what you're gonna say, because I'm getting really fucking good at this now. Okay, so you're gonna say, uh, uh, this is not happening. No, this isn't real. This is only happening in my head. People don't just materialize out of nowhere to the middle of the desert or a lake. <laughs> this shit only happens in dreams, right? No! Newsflash, kids. This is not happening in your head, suit. This is not happening for you in a dream, okay? This is from me. This is in my head, and it's my dream, and all of you sorry son of a bitches are along for the ride, because I am the king of my fuck land. And I'm real. Yeah. I'm hungry, and I am real. Whatever, Jake, you need to get over yourself. This is not your dream. Let me tell you, what I think, this is some sort of collective post-traumatic trauma. Nah, no, or... nah, Bob. <laughs> you know what? Check this shit out. Ladies and gentlemen. Booyah! Booyah! <laughs> Ah, row, 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 your boat down the stream. <laughs> you did this. You dreamt this away. Look, I've had enough. I have had enough. You know what? I think that we should just go to land and go off on into our own dreams. Because if I am in your twisted nightmare, then I have had enough. This isn't his dream. Really? Hey, uh, anybody here been to an oasis lately? What direction? West. Are you okay? 
You all felt that, right? Huh? Come on. Let's go west. Don't you get it? Miranda's extremely ill. Acute kidney failure, serious. She didn't just catch a cold. I need you in that meeting, David. I need you watching my back. Now, what if they have questions about the numbers? They're like piranhas in there. Miranda could be dying, Martin. The doctor will take care of her. Are you serious? Get through the meeting. One hour. Then go to the hospital and you can focus on her. Sorry. You're not sorry, I don't believe you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, I'm not sorry. What? Are you okay? I just talked to Miranda. Surprised you didn't see her. She walked right by. Miranda's dead. How are we supposed to climb up this shit? We don't. Huh? We're not supposed to. There's only one way out of here. What way is that? What, like, like an underwater cave or something? Nope. It's the only thing that I fear. Drowning. When I was a little kid, I used to have a recurring nightmare that I was under the water and I was fighting to get to the top and I never made it. It's always about you, isn't it? This is nothing like a dream, Jake. This is a riddle, it's a puzzle. It's like someone's testing us. And this is a scene where the asshole in the suit tells us how important he is. Think about it. What does every game have? Rules. Rules. Right. Quantum physics rules or monopoly rules? Yeah, because I left my rule book at home too. So I'm just wondering what the fuck we're supposed to do. Maybe we're not supposed to use this raft. What, you like want to pull a Jesus and walk out of here? Maybe we're supposed to make a different choice. You died, you got a reward. You got your food, you got your drink. We died, we hit a dead end. You opened up your wound, you got a reward. And what happens if we just die? More dead ends. Then why am I back here? Because I'm not done with you yet. 
Now's the time. What? Let's go. Right Who now? wants their reward right now? Just think about what you are saying, Martin. You want us all to drown because you think that this is a game. Staying on this raft is the thing that will get us killed. And what makes you think we're going to survive if we swim? We cannot even get on land. Why is this happening to me? Look, it's happening to all of us, Grace. you got to calm down. No, I am not calming down. I am not. <laughs> what did you just do? Martin? Trust me. Martin! We all have to leave Martin! this water. Martin! 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 Put it back! Put it back! Put it back! Give me that. Put it back. Give me that no! Shit. What are you out of your mind? Come on! This guy never ceases to amaze me, sis. You are, uh, you're unbelievable, man. You know what, actually, now that your kidney's a match, maybe, uh, Shut up, pour the drink. <laughs> Last one. Only because I like you. <laughs> no, seriously, man, you are not only saving Miranda's life, you're saving my sorry ass here. Ridiculous you sound right now. What is all that? The table with the food, it was all there. You should have listened to me, Grace. We drowned, Martin. You drowned us. The purpose of that place was not to stay on the raft. Don't you see? This is all a riddle. We can't die in this world. Great. Then why are you standing here with all these guns?
You're standing here too. You could have been standing anywhere, Martin, but you were here. I'm making a point, Grace. There is no dead. So there really are no guns. Hey, what the fuck is this? Let's see if there's any bullets. Don't you see? I was at the Oasis. I saw the table. It was just like this one. There was food all over it. I was rewarded because I did something risky, something crazy, something that took courage. Yeah, like killing us. So what do Rachel and I need to do to get some food? Yes, because you two have eaten and we haven't. Hey, hey, what we need to do is we need to find some bullets to kill him, okay? You mean Grace and I need to find the bullets to kill the both of you? What if in this world you need to die to get food and not kill anybody? This could all be a trick. No. I got food for all of you. I have no idea how this got here. Bullshit. Sure you know. No, I got food for all of you. I did. He... Hey, you know what? I don't believe you anymore. Hey, girls. Turns out that Suit here is the killer. Ain't that a bitch? You got your reward, but it wasn't food. It was the guns. Who are you? Huh? Who are you? Really? I know that gun. I've seen that gun before. I say we throw this away and we don't follow the path that is set for us. I don't know. I, I just, I don't understand, Martin. If the purpose of this place is for me to kill the three of you again, how can I do it with one bullet? Wait, no! No, no, whoa, whoa, whoa! This is not how it's supposed to go! Somebody should kill somebody, but it cannot be you, Jake! Bullshit. No, it has to be me or Grace. Give me the goddamn gun, Jake! The only fucker in this building that's gonna be using this gun is me. Question is, am I gonna kill? Huh? Mate? Huh? Me? supposed to use that bullet. I'm not going to. Where are you going? South. Find something new. You need 
to be strong. We need to get out of this, okay? We have to get out of this, okay? Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> I know why I'm here. What's that? I've always been an observer. I mean, I'm a photographer, for God's sakes. I use my camera to distance myself. I think it's safer to be alone. What's it got to do with? Here, I don't have a choice. I'm forced to confront each one of you. I mean, in different ways. And Rachel, I think she actually runs from things. And here, she's forced to turn and face things head on. What about Jake? Jake's just a prick. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. He's probably here to confront something, too. I don't know, maybe regain some of his humanity. That'd be a start. I mean, do we really know anyone? Know what's inside them? about you, Martin? Why do you think you're here? The first word that comes to mind is, is choice. The choices I've made. The choices I've made through fear. Through cowardice. I'm a slow learner, Grace. I don't know, maybe, maybe. Maybe we get a second chance. Another chance to do what? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I trust you'll find your way, Mark. Do it. It's not right. I can't do this. Is something wrong? You're married. Yes, but it's not that. It's different. I know. I feel like I'm married, and I had a ring.
to stick to the plan. do it. I can't do this. I'm sorry. Okay, Grace. Grace, you're gonna have to aim this at the right angle, okay? I can't do it, you guys. I cannot. I cannot do this. Pull the trigger. Come on, Grace. You have to. We have to know. But what if this is the last level? And then I kill all three of you, and then I'm left here all alone forever. Uh, pull the trigger. Pull the fucking trigger! Pull the fucking trigger! No! No! I fucking hate you! Actually, now that your kidney's a match, it's maybe not. Shut up. No, seriously, man, you, uh, you're not only saving Miranda's life here. You're saving my sorry ass. Can't do it, Anna. Can't leave my job for three months. Walden will take over my territory in three seconds flat. Besides, we're in debt and a mortgage. They'll find someone else. We don't need all this. This big house. It's just the two of us. We mainly live in the kitchen anyway. I thought you liked having a pool. Yeah. We could move to a smaller place. We're not moving. You've always been working very hard. You know, three months off would be good for us. I can take care of you, feed you, massage you, service all your needs. No. Can't do it. Look, it's no big deal. I mean, there's lists, there's databases, donors, I mean, I can't lose this place. I'm not willing to lose this place. I couldn't handle it. We'll be okay. Help! Help! Huh? Martin! 
are you talking about? I called the hospital. You didn't show up for your second screening. Listen to me. If I take three months off my work, I will lose my job. If I lose my job, you won't be far behind me. Trust me, you won't last a week without me watching your back. And may I remind you that the company's health insurance is paying for Miranda's medical bills. So I am doing my part. That's great. That's great. Thanks, Martin. Thanks for doing your part. Martin, I can't do this. Yes, you can. I haven't been able to focus on work, man. All I can think about is her. I don't sleep. When I do, he's got them nightmares about her funeral. You know what the worst part is? You just keep denying it. Denying what? You fired him, didn't you? You can warn all you want after you seal the deal. Martin. You have to. It's not a matter of choice. I already told the old man you would. Jesus, what, you get one promotion, you turn into Genghis Khan? Take no prisoners, right? Right, remember? I listened to your sorry-ass plan, and I thought I did the right thing by standing beside you like a good wife. No, I just don't feel like Listen I Listen to me. I don't want you to feel. I want you to use your head. I want you to pull yourself together. I want you to grow some fucking balls. I am done babysitting you. And now, I feel responsible. Got a lot of stake here. Yeah, like your fucking stock options, For you huh? too, Berkman. No, nothing of this will bring back Miranda. Nothing. You just took the last thing that he had left. Don't you fuck this up! I am counting on you! He dropped the ball, Anna. When it comes down to it, friendships aside, business is business.
So what do you think, Martin? All of this? All of this is showing me something about myself. Typical. Hey, you ever think maybe not everything's about you? No, it is. There's some kind of lesson. You, you opened yourself up. You looked inside yourself. Me, I'm like a shark. I keep moving forward. I've never looked back. I don't look inside myself. Perpetual motion. I analyze. I overanalyze. I always thought the thought and logic, that is how you get things done. But this place, this is, this is, this forces me to do something different. This is illogical. This is, it's feeling, it's uh, intuitive. This isn't even a conversation, Martin. You're not even talking to us right now. Why do you have to learn all these things? Why now? What's the urgency? Maybe we get a second chance. Second chance to do what? Trying to figure out. Actually, now that your kidney's a match, can't do it. Miranda could be dying, Martin. You finally lost it, huh, Sue? No. I think I found it. You're not Jake. You're David Burke. You're not Rachel, you're Miranda Berkman. Where's Grace? Where's Grace? You know what the worst part is? If you wanted someone to roll over and do your bidding, you should have married that blonde. I'll take care of you. And I listened to your sorry ass plan and thought I was doing the right thing by standing beside you like a good wife. And now I feel responsible. I remember being at a funeral, pretending to be devastated, you know? I was actually kind of glad the fuck was dead. You fired him, didn't you? Somehow we're all connected. I've seen all of you before. What you doing to me? What the fuck did you do to me? I want you to think. Use your head. I had a lot of obligations. There's a lot at stake here. People depend on me. David depended on me. What, well, like your fucking stock options? So in a dog-eat-dog -dog world, Martin, you're the top dog. Martin, I can't do this. I have nightmares about a goddamn funeral. Miranda's dead. You weren't there the one time when he needed you the most. When it comes down to it, you gotta put friendships aside. Business is business. The dirt was still fresh on her grave, Martin. I don't even know who you are anymore. Hello!
I was with my wife. We were arguing. I can't remember. You took away the one thing he had left. Yeah. Yeah. I don't feel very good. It's always about you, isn't it? Ever think maybe it's your conscience pounding your brain? Anna! Me, I'm like a shark. I never stop, I never look behind, I never look inside. You're used to letting everybody do your dirty work for you. No, Jake, you gotta stop. He ratted me out. He trusted you and you betrayed him. Enough, Jake! Jake, stop! No! Grace! Don't be... fucking killed us. You can't die in this world. This could all be a trick. No, I got food for all of you. <sighs> I've seen that gun before. Anna! You said you were ready. You said you had the numbers that you could close the deal. No. You said that. <sighs> Anna! Give me the goddamn gun, Jake! Anna! Turns out Sue here is the killer. Anna! Your photographer. Landscapes mostly. Kidneys are vital to life. Can't do it. I'll find someone else. I called the hospital. You didn't show up for your follow-up screening. If I take three months off, I will lose my job. If I lose my job, you lose your job. Trust me. It's the company's health insurance that's paying Miranda's medical bills. No one is going to die. We're already dead. Business taught me you only get one bite of the apple. That's it. That was me. I hung on tight and I bit deep. But if life is like a little bird you hold in your hand, you squeeze it too tight, you kill it. You hold it too loose, it'll fly away. You have to hold it just right. Someone once told me about our spirit living on. Funny, I did my best to crush any ones that got in my way. And yet, now all I want is another shot. I mean, I don't want to leave it like this. <laughs> 